This Home is Here digital exclusive is brought to you by Atlas Insurance Agency, First Hawaiian Bank, Pesha Hawaii, and Locations. We use stars, the rising and setting points of stars, which, of which navigators know hundreds, to figure out how to find our direction. This is the Hawaiian Star Compass. It's based on the Papu, or the star compass that was taught to us by Papa Mao. We have Akau, which is north, cardinal directions, Hema south, Hikina east, and Komohana west. Within these, each of these four cardinal directions, we have seven star houses. A star house is where celestial bodies rise and set in. And in each quadrant, we have the same seven star houses. La, it means sun. We have Aina, which means land. We have Noyo, which is a Hawaiian turn, and it helps the navigators find land. Then Manu, which means bird. We have Nalani, which is the heavens. Naleo, the voices from the heavens. And then Haka, which means an empty, the relatively empty skies around the north and south celestial poles. Each of the quadrants has a name as well. We have Ko'olau, Malanai, Kona, and Ho'olua, which represent the main winds in Hawaii. Uh, within the Hawaiian star compass, we have right where the manu is, the bird, um, th the navigator and the canoe are in the center of this mental construct. On Hokulea, there are markings on the rails that represent the 32 star houses, each of which is 11.25 degrees apart. Right, so 11.25 degrees, 32 star houses, 360 degrees, which represents the visual horizon while we're, while we're sailing. So stars um, travel in parallel tracks from east to west on their daily cycles. For example, Let's say that a star rises in Manu Malanai. Go across, it will set in Manu Kona. Right? Let's try another example. It's your turn. If a star rises in La Malanai, where do you think it's going to set? La Kona. Great job. <laughs> 